let's discuss question 9.19 standard 12 physics ray optics ncrt textbook so there are two ways of doing this problem the question states that there is, there is one wall which is separated by the another wall by a gap of 3 meters there is a bulb on the first wall and we are supposed to obtain its image on the another wall so what should be the maximum focal length of this convex lens okay now first of all we need to understand that once you want to obtain the image on the wall this wall behaves as a screen and then there will be a re real image okay and the real images are inverted something like this so we know that the for real image the minimum gap between the object and the image is 4f so when you keep the object at twice the focal length you get the image of same size at 2f on the other side of the lens this is the minimum gap 4f is the minimum distance between the object and the image if you even slightly displace the object the image will be comparatively move very far away and in that case the distance between the object and the image will be more so the minimum gap between the object and the image for real image is 4f so which means that 4f needs to be kept as 3 meters so f would be 3 by 4 that is 0.75 meters now we need to understand why this is the maximum focal length of the lens right because in the problem it is asked maximum focal length it is because the distance between the wall walls is 3 meters so if you increase this focal length slightly say for example from 3 to 3.2 meters then the gap between the real object and image will be more than 3 meters we are supposed to keep the images and the object at 3 meters gap correct so if you try to increase the focal length then this gap will also increase and we need to keep this gap as 3 meters so this is the maximum focal length so we cannot increase the focal length beyond 0.75 meters this is the easiest way of solving now there is an another way that is a differential method now let's see this so we know that 1 upon f that is equal to 1 upon v minus 1 upon u now this distance is u this distance is v and u plus v has to be kept as 3 meters now we need to use sign conventions here it is because there are numbers given had it been no numbers given we should not have used the sign conventions so we need to use sign conventions correct so this distance u will become negative please understand if this number would not have been given I will never use the sign conventions sign conventions are to be used whenever some numbers are given correct all right so uh, this becomes v is equal to u plus 3 and now i'm going to substitute this over here so we get 1 upon f that is equal to 1 upon 3 plus u minus 1 upon u now just taking the lcm you will get this as 1 upon f that is equal to u minus u minus 3 upon 3u plus u, u square sorry so this multiplied by this this multiplied by this and these two multiplication is over here this is 3u plus u square correct so let's write this once again so that there is no confusion u minus u minus 3 upon 3u plus u square now just doing the reciprocal so f is equal to u square plus 3u upon minus 3 so i can just write this as minus u square by 3 and it will be minus u correct now since we want this to be maximum so it's first order differentiation with respect to u should be zero correct because f is a function of u right now so if you want this to be maximum then its first order differentiation with respect to u should be zero correct i'll have to equate that and i'll have to find out so d by du of this entire number minus u square by 3 minus u is equal to zero 
now this will be minus 2u by 3 and then this will be minus 1 is equal to 0. So solving this further you will get minus 2u by 3 that is equal to 1 so u is equal to minus 3 by 2u sorry minus 3 by 2 that's it because this is 3 by 2u so you will get this as u. Now let's find out v. Now we know that u is equal to minus 3 by 2 so I am going to just simply place the value as v is equal to u plus 3 so v is equal to u is minus 3 by 2 and this will be plus 3 so I am going to get the value of u as plus 3 by 2 right now since I know the value of u and v I am simply going to use the lens formula so 1 upon f that is equal to 1 upon v now for the real images v are positive right so that is plus 3 by 2 and then minus of 1 upon since I know the object distance and object distance is negative so it is minus 3 by 2 so solving this further this is 2 by 3 and this again becomes plus 2 by 3 so this is 1 upon f that is equal to 4 by 3 that means f is equal to 3 by 4 this is our answer in meters because everything is given in meter.